We started off the morning with a late breakfast at a local restaurant in Nefbit before driving 25 minutes to the ancient site of Mycenae. The first location we stopped at was the treasury of Atreus. The tomb dates from the 14th century BC. A Mycenaean king would have been buried here with all his weapons and enough food and drink to sustain him in the underworld. The Lion Tomb is situated outside the city walls and was constructed about 1350 BC. It was found with a collapsed tholos and three empty pit graves. The ancient site of Mycenae was once the home to the legendary Agamemnon. During the second millennium BC, Mycenae was the most powerful kingdom in Greece. You enter Agamemnon's fortress through the Lion's Gate, which was built in the 14th century BC. In the 9th century BC, Homer talked about well-built Mycenae, rich in gold, in his poems, the Iliad and the Odyssey. These poems were thought to be a myth until amateur archaeologist Heinrich Schliemann unearthed Mycenae in 1874. A favorite traveling activity we enjoy is using flashlights to explore dark, creepy spaces. So of course, we're looking forward to walking down the dark stairway that led to the city's cistern deep beneath Mycenae. Unfortunately, it was gated off so we could only shine our flashlights into the darkness. The temperature outside was 105 degrees Fahrenheit and we were hot, dusty, and thirsty. After finding a little cave to cool off and drink our warm water, we decided to head back to the car. We stopped to get fruit slushies from a shop in the parking lot before driving 45 minutes to our next stop, the ancient theater of Epidaurus. The theater was built in the fourth century BC and is one of the best preserved ancient Greek structures in existence. It is made of limestone and can see up to 14,000 people. Because the theater was so remote, its stone was never pilfered and it remained undiscovered until the 1870s. The theater was well known for its amazing acoustics. If a coin is dropped from the theater center, it can be heard from the highest seat. After a long, hot day, we left our apartment and walked over the hill to the local beach, ending our day with dinner and a swim.
join me next time as we explore the archaeological site of Mistress. Thanks for watching.